Welcome to Friday. My name's Ken Domic. It's a beautiful day. A little overcast, but the sun keeps poking its little shiny face out every once in a while. Give us some extreme heat. I uh, walked Sam and this morning, and, and uh, I was just, just walking. I was sweating. That's how hot it is. I don't know the exact temperature. Oh, it says, oh, where's my temperature thing? 23 degrees Celsius, which technically isn't that hot, but it feels very humid and hot right now. So headed into Lafroy this time I've got my keys with me to go check my mailbox uh, and also have to mail something out. So let's get that done and then we're headed over to McDonald's to do the blueberry crumble sundae for today's food review. And uh, I looked it up to see if it's only in Canada, if it's only in the States. It seems that it's in Canada and the United States. So I checked to see how many other food reviewers have done it. And I came up with a big zero. And uh, not, it didn't look like one person has done it. So I guess it's uh, a new item they've never done before. And even though it's a new item and nobody's ever done it before, nobody's done it now. So I'm, I'm usually like middle of the pack when it comes to being right on top of everything. So hopefully today it works out for us. All right, let's get to the post office. one envelope from Harvey's I believe they they enjoyed my review I did a while back and so they said they'd send me a gift card or two give to the give to the family so thank you very much Kara Kara is the big company that owns Swiss Chalet Harvey's uh, Montana's and a bunch of other restaurants so uh, thank you very much and now we have to head to McDonald's let's go I almost forgot to tell you guys that uh, this is day three and I'm still showing the signs of my wasp stings this one's not as red anymore but it's still kind of solid and, and itchy and then this one last night like the swelling went up into my hand and you couldn't see these knuckles as much as the other one and uh, none of the veins were showing or nothing on this hand so yeah, we were talking about that last night uh, uh, during our dinner one other thing so let me know in the comments below if you got stung by a wasp lately and how long did the effects last on you because we got to figure this out why is it taking three days for my wasp stings to disappear i don't know this is the worst reaction i've ever had to wasp stings on another note uh last night after the goulash house we went to like a crepe place and had a peanut butter and banana crepe with uh caramel drizzle on top of it. I think they did caramel and chocolate drizzle on top. And just the, I'll show you a picture right there. How you like that? Oh my goodness. And then I had a coffee, which I shouldn't have had because it kept me up till three o'clock in the morning. Uh, I just, I just kept work. Like I got home, watched a bunch of YouTube and uh, then I went and uh, did a couple more uncut and raws, got them in the queue ready to go. And I was still awake and I'm like, okay, well, let's play some Minecraft. So I played Minecraft for about two hours and uh, I was building a zombie XP trap so I can get some XP points so I can upgrade all my armor and equipment. Anyway, so that's what I did at three o'clock in the morning then I got up at eight and I wasn't very, I was very groggy. And uh, so I reset my alarm till 8.30 and then I got up at 8.30 
and then I think I went back to bed just for a little bit and then Carol came in the room because she was getting stuff ready for what she needed to do today. See, look, it's itchy. It's itchy. <laughs> All right, off to McDonald's. Let's go. Made it to the Bradford McDonald's and I don't see it on the boards. If it's not here, it'll wreck my day. I can't see it. They usually have, especially something new like that, there's usually some one of these boards that'll have the blueberry crumble note on it. Hmm. This could be bad. Well, let's go with the flow. No, I see it. I see it. This guy just hogging up, waiting. Doesn't know which line to take. Which one? Which one's he gonna take? I, I suspect he's gonna go left, but uh, very long lineup. This McDonald's is always long lineups. Come on! <laughs> oh, he's going right. I totally misread that one. I'm gonna go left. I can make it. Arm crunch. Nice. Hello, what can I get to? Hi, I'd like to try the uh, the blueberry crumble sundae. Okay. One with the crumble and one without the crumble. Okay. Thank you, that's it. You're welcome. Your total is 630. Thanks. You're welcome. So they do, and they will. Very nice. Hello. Ah, uh, yes. Thank you. 630. Visa? Sure. Just tap it. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, window. Have a great day. Right, thanks. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Two Sundays coming up, people. Hi. Hello. You go. Thank Have you very much. You Bye -bye. too. All right, ladies and gentlemen, just trying to find a good parking spot. So I thought I'd try two, one with crumble and one without to see which one is better, just to help you guys make that decision yourself. I came back and one, damn it. All right, it's, oh, no, 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 uh, Blueberry burps. All right, vlog people, vlog people. All done, got a bonus spoon for yet another time. So we'll put that in there. I didn't put the nuts on my Sunday. I didn't even talk about them in the video. I just went straight for the Sunday. I never put nuts on my Sunday. So I'll bring them home. I'm not even sure what, if anybody in my whole family would use that or not. We got lots of extra napkins. I cleaned my car the other day and then Ben used it once and left tons of stuff in here. There's this. So he bought a chocolate bar. That's the kind of chocolate bar Ben bought. I guess he ate the whole thing and then left the wrapper for me to clean up. So I'll have to kill him tonight when I get home or when he gets home. What is all this crap? This crap, oh my car. Left a water bottle, that, and oh, this. <sighs> Kids. All right, let's go home. afternoon put the video together and uh, now I have to go pick up Ben at work it's uh, I don't know what time it is I think it's 6 30 so it's almost 6 30 I'm supposed to pick him up at 6 30 he's supposed to work till 7 but they I guess figured out that they could let him go half hour early so we're gonna go pick him up grab a pizza head home eat up the pizza watch a movie, have a beer, relax, and have a great weekend. I left that, uh, that open comment on my big channel in the last video saying, I want to know how you guys are feeling. And a lot of people really like that. So I got a lot of comments on how people were feeling, which was great. All right, so let's pick up Ben and uh, get our pizza. Got Ben in the 
car, picked them up. Now we're just gonna go into Reginald's, which I did a review here already. Getting some pizza, doing the meat lovers. Of course. Hello. All right, got a bunch of pizzas. Ben's the, the pizza boy. He's gonna be like driving a yellow Mustang delivering pizzas in five minutes or less. What? It's the it's yellow, isn't it? No, no, I'm talking about the blue one. There's a blue one. Yeah, no, the yellow one's like a 2013. I'm talking about a 1980. Oh, oh, Ben, don't do that. It'll all fall over. Yeah, yeah Ben's doing. No, the one I'm most. All right, let's go home and eat. All right, let's go home. Cool. Cool. Cool.